Hey guys, I know I haven't been around in a really long time and I just want to apologize for that. I've been crazy super tired from work but now I'm on vacation for the next few weeks so hopefully I'll be able to pump out some videos for you guys. But today I wanted to share with you that on Sunday I went to the makeup show and I had a really nice time. When I went last year I was by myself and I went late and it was really crowded and I really didn't have a lot of fun but this year my mom came with me and we went early. We were one of the first few people online and it was really really nice. Um, I was able to get pretty much everything that I wanted to. I, I forgot a couple things because we left and we were going to come back and we ended up being exhausted so we just said screw it. But um, yeah, I just want to share with you the, um, the things that I picked up. The first place I went, which if you do go to the makeup show, you gotta go. If you want makeup forever, you gotta go right there because otherwise you just wait 15-20 minutes after it starts and the line, it's like like a swarm of flies. <laughs> it gets crazy over there. So I was actually the first person over there. So I picked up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven shadows. I picked up a palette and seven shadows. One of them I already have in here, but um, I picked up, here they are right here, and I had to write down the names because I already put them in, so this is 52, I'm sorry, this is um, number 5, this is 52, this is number 9, I already had um, 92. Uh, 93, oh sorry, nothing here, 93, 53, 83, and 60. And I swatched them here so you can see. Makeup Forever you know is got excellent pigmentation, so yeah, that's it right here. And I picked up two of their eye pencils, one in, where is it, 20L and 23L. And this one is 20L and that's like, um, like an evergreen. And then right here is um, 23L and that is like a champagne beige color. I did pick one. A couple of the um, I wanted a glitter they didn't have it and I wanted one of the cream liners and it was on my list and when I came home and I checked it wasn't in my bag but thank God I didn't pay for it I wanted the emerald green cream shadow it was beautiful but I could pick that up I guess anytime so the next place I went to I believe was OCC and I picked up five of their lip tars. And they're not the same size as they were before. Because I have a couple of the old ones here for comparison. This one is this one's the old one, and this one is the new one. So you can see there is quite a bit of difference in size, but as you already know, you only use a tiny, tiny little bit of these, and it's still too much. <laughs> so, um, right now I am wearing this one. This is Memento. Let me see if I could swatch some of these really quick. Oh, I already put down too much. Okay, so I swatched them for you, and here we go. The first one is Memento. The second one is Safety Orange, which is, those first two are my favorite. Maybe the first three are my favorite. The third one is Anime. The fourth one, what is that, Demure. And the fifth one is Grandma. Yeah. So, 
I had a bunch more on my list that I want not a bunch more but I had like four other ones that I wanted to get but I was afraid that I was gonna run out of money so I decided to just pick those up but I did go to Smashbox and I got two of the halo like sort of like it's sort of like like mineral foundation kind of I don't think it is mineral foundation but I use I used it before and I absolutely love it it doesn't if you're looking for something with heavy coverage it does not cover really anything it just gives you sort of um a little bit more of a finished look so a lot of times I'm running late for work and I don't want to you know sit there and put a whole bunch of foundation on and everything so I just sort of put this all over and I got Usually I'm fair, but seeing that the warmer months are coming up, I did get... Oh no, I gave my mother the wrong one. Oh, okay. I got one in fair and one in light, and I guess I gave my mom the wrong one because I have two fairs here. So, um, let me open it up and show you what it looks like. It does come with a mini um, like kabuki brush, which I don't use. But, um, I really like this because you just shave off what you need. So it comes like this, and then you just move this around, and you see? You just, and then you stick your brush in there and you put it on. And... I just love the way it works. I have combination mostly dry skin, so usually like powder foundation on my skin looks kind of dry and flaky, and this does not at all. It gives me a really nice, just smooth out look. So, and I picked up, they also have the same, I guess it's the same formula, the Halo um, bronzer, and it looks like this. And it's the same idea. You just shave off what you want to use and then apply it. So I got that. And I picked up, I don't know what booth I picked these up from, but I got mascara wands, um, a palette and a, a spatula. I also stopped at Yabby and I picked up one of their palettes and the one I got is called World of Paints and it has a mirror which you don't need to see but there are 40 um shadows in here. They're all very shimmery. They have almost like a cream-like consistency. They're powder, but they're just so, um, they're so, like, pigmented. They feel almost creamy, but, um, I don't know. Let's just pick one so you could see. That's not a good one. So green. So you can see, I don't know, I know that these do come out, but I tried to get them out and I ended up kind of jabbing them a little bit. So I think if you go to the website, they will tell you what colors are in here because um, you can buy them separately. But this, oh, I'm making a mess. This was a really, really good um, buy. Definitely, definitely worth it.